Hello, I am Ram Gopal from presentationprocess.com. In this edition of PowerPoint Smart Art tutorial series, you will learn how to create waterfall model using Smart Art. In the process, you will also learn how to convert this text-based slide into this interesting looking diagram. First, let us get a quick overview of waterfall model. Waterfall model is usually used in software development processes. The diagram shows the various stages in software development and the process flow is shown as sequential steps flowing downwards and hence the name waterfall model. Let us see how the text is set up for to create the diagram. You can see that the title of the various steps in the process are shown as level 1 text and the explanation for each of the process steps is shown as level 2 text. When we convert this text into diagram, we need to take keep in mind that it is a step down process because the flow is downwards. So let us see how to convert this text into a smart art diagram. First, let us select all the text, right click and go to convert to smart art, ignore these default options and go to more smart art graphics. Since we want to illustrate a process, we will search for options under process. Since this is a step down process, the right diagram would be this one called a step down process diagram and as soon as we click OK, the text gets converted into a beautiful waterfall model. Though the conversion is made, the second level text is so small that the person, the last person in the room may not be able to clearly see the text here. So how do we make the text more visible? There are a couple of things that we need to keep in mind to make sure that the text is visible. The first point is the size of the font depends on the length of the longest sentence in the level 2 text. So one way to make the size increase the size is to reduce the length of the level 2 sentences. Once you do the initial pruning of the sentences, the second step is to increase the width of the text boxes. The point to note here is the width of the text boxes are limited by the width of the bounding box. So if you want to increase the length, the width of these uh, text boxes, the first step we need to do is to increase the width of the bounding box, which we are going to do now. And once we do that, we can increase the length of these text boxes. So I'm going to do that by doing this. So instead of uh, having them folded over in two lines, you can have them appear in one line. And we also need to make sure that the length is appropriate even after increasing the font size. So we are going to increase the font size and then increase the length of the text boxes. So let us select all and then go to home and increase the sizes the time we are happy with the result okay so this seems reasonable now this the text boxes should be able to accommodate this length I think this one is slightly bigger than this one so I think we will standardize this level 2 text to 14 and level 1 text to 20 all right so first let us take all the level 1 text boxes and let us increase the length. Now they seem to be reasonable, maybe we can reduce it slightly so they are better. Now this is good enough. The next is to make sure that these sentences don't fold into two sentences, two levels, they need to be in one row so we are going to make that adjustment we will increase the length here yeah they are in uh, yeah that is good enough and as we make the length adjustment we also move these text boxes so that they are aligned properly 
this is one of the limitations of smart art you need to do a lot of wrestling to get uh, the text to appear clear and easily uh, readable and that is one of the things you need to live with when you use smart art and i think there we go i think we need to move this slightly here and that's good enough maybe we can increase the bounding box a little more and that should do it now we can move this whole thing here maybe we can slightly move this this is there is no shortcut to achieving the perfect result you need to work with the options do a lot of this trial and error till the time you get the whole thing in place i think the only thing where we have an issue is here so maybe we can uh, move this a little bit this way this way and move it this way and move it slightly to the side it can sometimes test your whole patience so we'll move this here this side because one is dependent on the other so till the time you get everything moved you will not be able to get the diagram the way you want it so we have made some serious adjustment here and there it is now it is far more easy to read and we can also move this one slightly to the left this is because we have moved the first level text and the next thing we can do is to make this look more beautiful so we go to design and we go to change colors option and use this option we can also use the smart art style of your choice and there it is our waterfall model is finally ready <sighs> that's a lot of work if you don't want to do all this hard work and if you are a busy business presenter who doesn't have the time to do the wrestling with smart art diagrams then you can always go for off the shelf solutions like our powerpoint ceo packs i wish to show you some example waterfall diagrams taken from our powerpoint ceo packs and you see how the diagrams are significantly better looking and easy to work with compared to the smart art diagrams here we have the waterfall diagram where we have used interesting looking icons to make the diagram more memorable this is a 3d version of waterfall diagram and here we have written the level 1 text and here is the option available for you to write level 2 text and this is an example for a different type of step down diagram you can see how we have worked with our various um, objects in 3d it takes a lot of time and effort for any presenter to create such professional looking diagrams you can save a whole lot of time a whole lot of hard work by choosing solutions like powerpoint ceo packs volume 1 and 2 The two CEO packs are more than 1,600 fully editable charts and graphics for CEOs and business presenters. Just choose the template that matches your thought and replace the sample text with your own text, and your business slides get ready in no time. Creating professional quality business slides has never been easier. Hope you liked our tutorial on creating waterfall model in SmartArt. If you want to learn more such tutorials, please visit us at presentationprocess.com. There are tons of useful articles, videos and tutorials to help you improve your presentation skills and PowerPoint skills. Thanks a lot for watching the video and happy presenting.